we want to compute the probability of drawing two hearts from a standard deck of 52 cards. We can indicate this as the probability of two hearts. We know the probability of an event is equal to the favorable number of outcomes divided by the total number of outcomes, which means in our case, the favorable number of outcomes is the number of ways we can select two hearts from the hearts in the deck. And since there are 13 hearts in the deck, the number of ways of selecting the two hearts is 13 choose two. And we use a combination because the order does not matter. So we have 13 choose two as the number of favorable outcomes divided by the total number of outcomes, which is the number of ways of selecting two cards from the deck of 52 cards, which is 52 choose two. And now let's evaluate this on the calculator. Let's enter open parenthesis, and then we enter n, which is 13. And now we select combination by pressing math, right arrow to probability, and then the combination is option three. So we press three, or arrow down and press enter. I'm gonna go ahead and press three. We enter r, which is two, right arrow, close parenthesis, and then divided by open parenthesis, n, which is 52, and we select combination again, and enter R, which is two, right arrow, close parenthesis, and enter. To four decimal places, we have approximately 0 0.0588, which is equal to 5.88%. So this is one way to find the probability. We can also think of drawing two cards as drawing one card and then drawing a second card without replacement. And therefore we can also think of this as two dependent events. So let's also find this probability a second way. Let's indicate the probability as a probability of drawing a heart and then another heart without replacement. So because we do not have replacement, these two events are dependent and therefore this is equal to the probability of drawing a heart times the probability of drawing a heart given a heart has already been drawn without replacement. So this is equal to the probability of a heart times the probability of a heart given a heart has already been drawn. And now to determine the product of these two probabilities. First we have the probability of drawing a heart because there are 13 hearts out of the 52 cards. The probability of drawing a heart is 13 50 seconds. And then we have times the probability of a heart given a heart has already been drawn. So let's just assume the ace of hearts was the first card. Notice now there are only 12 hearts remaining and also only a total of 51 cards. And therefore the probability of drawing a heart given a heart has already been drawn is equal to 12 51st or 12 divided by 51. So this product should give us the same probability that we have above. Let's go to the calculator and verify. We have 13 divided by 52 times 12 divided by 51, which does give us the same probability, approximately 0 0.0588, which is 5.88%. I hope you found this helpful.